Welcome! You're watching the thrift store and now they're doing Disney on a budget. While Disney is known for its signature whimsy that has enchanted many a generation, it's also known for tackling important subjects with a graceful smile and a full heart, and in this case, a full plate. For example, did you know that this month, November, is National Diabetes Month? For those who are living with type 1 diabetes, November can be especially difficult. But it doesn't have to be. Making the right choices now can have a profoundly positive impact on you and yours right now and later in life as you grow up. And believe me, you will grow up. For those who are thinking along the lines of Peter Pan saying, I don't want to grow up. That's a bad idea. Last year, more than 100,000 Americans, kids and adults, let's just say, didn't grow up at all because of T1D. You owe it to yourself to make the right choices. If I can't express that enough adequately, well, I'll leave Mickey and his pals to do the job. And along the way, provide plenty of healthy servings of fun. That's the aim of Dishing It Up Disney Style, a cookbook for families with type 1 diabetes, a joint effort between Lily USA LLC, one of the leading healthcare and medicine specialists, and Disney in their joint venture called T1 Everyday Magic. That's a good resource for those who are looking to manage and cope with type 1 diabetes. I'll provide that link in the description. This book was not meant for resale. Heck, it wasn't meant for sale at all. I believe this is only meant to be given out for free at doctor's offices and healthcare clinics. Whatever the case, I bought it for $2.99 from my happy place, Unique Thrift Store in Patterson. We'll start right away. We're highlighting four recipes in here, and we begin with breakfast. Goofy's Zucchini Frittata. What? Vegetables for breakfast? Ah, uh, yes. We're always looking for ways to sneak in a few veggies into our kids' meals, and breakfast is a good time to do just that, especially when it comes to this scrumptious looking for tata. Each recipe in here, which is divided up into the usual breakfast, lunches, dinners, snacks and sweets, contain a photograph, and a tip from the Disney character contributing the recipe on how kids can get involved in the cooking process. Goofy's tip you can't make a frittata without breaking a few eggs. Young ones can practice their egg cracking skills and then stir the mixture. Just don't let them get whisked away. That's a high quality photograph. The staff of Disney Family Fun Magazine contributed the recipes and took the photographs. Oh, and every recipe in here does come with some nutritional stats. Very helpful to have around. Next up, we have Rapunzel's Chicken and Biscuit Pie for lunch. Rapunzel's tip? The way I see it, cooking is a really good excuse to get your hands dirty. Kids will love working the butter into the biscuit dough. Right on Rapunzel. If there's one thing kids love more than helping out in the cooking process, it's getting their hands dirty along the way. Really getting hands on. Without that, what's the fun of cooking all about, really? For dinner we have Donald's Chicken Fajitas. Should it be duck fajitas? Oh well. I guess we don't want duck on duck action in that sense, right? That would be a bit weird. But anyway, his tip for these chicken fajitas? Have dinner south of the border with these chicken fajitas. Mama and Papa should grill the chicken, but Los Niños, the kids, will enjoy setting out the toppings and rolling their fajitas. How tasty does that look? And now we move on to the snacks and sweets. Bell's Better Brownies. Bell's tip? Some people might say that delicious healthy brownies are a myth or a fairy tale, but that simply isn't true. While mom and dad melts the butter, kids can measure and mix the dry ingredients. And because this can be a bit finicky for those with T1 or T2D, I'm going to zoom in on the nutritional stats for you. 85 calories, 4 grams of fat, 11 carbohydrates, 1 gram of fiber, 1 gram of protein, and a 1 carbohydrate choice. Well, I'd like to say that there are a few Pixar characters in here. Sadly, there aren't any in the mix. But that's okay. The recipes in here look so scrumptious. They're simple to prepare. And kids can definitely get in on all this fun. I mean, if there's one thing I'm strongly adamant about, it's about kids helping out in the kitchen and having fun along the way. There's no denial or deprivation of that when Disney characters get in the mix. Literally. 
Nothing brings a family together like a delicious home-cooked meal, especially when parents and kids can take part in preparing and enjoying it. But families with children who have type 1 diabetes sometimes have a difficult time finding recipes that satisfy everyone's appetites and nutritional needs. That's why Lily and Disney and Dissage, who published this book, have joined forces to create Disney It Up, Disney Style, a cookbook for families with type 1 diabetes. Grab an apron and dive in. It's time to start Disney It Up, Disney Style. And once again, this is the first of two Disney It Up, Disney Style cookbooks. There's more Disney It Up, Disney Style where that came from in the links below. If you want to check out all the recipes from this cookbook and the next one, make sure to check out T1EverydayMagic.com. In the meantime, this gets 5 out of 5 claps. And there's another diabetes cookbook that I'm going to review for those who are coping with type 1 or type 2 diabetes. That would be the complete diabetes cookbook from America's Test Kitchen. That will be done outside of the series later this month. When it comes to tackling important subjects on full plates, I'm not taking any chances with a bunch of no-name brands. But for now, that's the diss on Dissy It Up Dissy Style. Still to come, the Dissy Pictopia game. Thank you for joining us for another week of Dissy Deals, and remember... Whether you struggle with T1D or T2D or not, dreams still come true. On the flip side. Something old and something new. Something for everyone. And a game that won't have you feeling blue.